And that's Richard Engel reporting live from Cairo, Indiana. Senator Dan Coats served as a U.S. ambassador to Germany from 2001 to 2005. Senator Coats, kind enough to join us today on the phone to talk about the dangers that diplomats face overseas. Senator Coates, let me begin by asking what your reaction to uh, this violence was in Libya. Well, of course, our thoughts and prayers go out to the family of Ambassador uh, Stevens and the families of those who died in this attack. Uh, my thoughts were that um, we're still dealing with a dangerous world. Uh, there are people out there that um, want to take down the United States or anybody that's symbolically or representative of the United States. So whether it's the American flag in front of a consulate or the American ambassador or someone in uniform, um, this was a stark uh, reminder that our war against uh, radical Islamic terrorists uh, is, is ongoing. Uh, there's no justification for what was taking place, and there's some are trying to justify it on the basis of some film that came out a year ago and so forth, but there is no justification for anyone to use like that uh, to bring these kind of attacks, and so it's just a tragic situ situation. Senator Coates, what more can be done to protect other U.S. embassies around the world in the wake of this Libyan attack that killed Chris Stevens? Well, you know, I served uh, just immediately after 9-1-1, and, of course, uh, the host country is responsible for providing the security uh, of uh, ambassadors and those representing the United States. And some countries can do that better than others, but that is their responsibility, and clearly that was a, there was a breakdown in, uh, in Egypt and in, uh, in Libya. You're always uh, kind of caught between this balance between adequate security and performing your diplomatic duties. Uh, you want to be free to engage uh, the people of the country that uh, you're serving in. Um, you don't want to be locked down and hustled in the back doors of uh, certain places. And, and I wanted that freedom when I was ambassador, yet I knew that the threat was out there. So uh, you can never adequately fully protect that. But the real responsibilities come with the host country. I was fortunate to serve in Germany, and the Germans um, gave me very adequate security. But uh, this means we have to be vigilant and on guard and perhaps even look at some of our uh, some of the things that's happening in our embassies around the world to make sure that, that those countries are fully committed to protecting us. Indiana Senator Dan Coates, I want to thank you for spending time with us talking about this breaking news, this tragedy that took